I found it fascinating on Twitter today. Um, I think I put out something about, um, you know, the people who aren't talking about this. And I, I think I put out the, uh, something like the Bush lawyers. It's interesting to watch all the Bush lawyers online today trying to figure out how Winston's comments technically don't reference or don't mean or don't point towards the Holocaust. And I just want to show the actual full quote because this is on Winston Peters' own page. So this is his information. Um, so the th other thing, and I'm sure you guys know this, but any, for anyone that doesn't, the, the, the Nazi Germany comment was an ad lib. It wasn't a part of a script. So the script stops where it says others and then he ad libbed the way through. So this is him thinking it would be a good idea. I'm sure his, his uh, script writers were going, oh, <laughs> but this was an ad lib. And this is the paragraph before and what he said afterwards. It was not just ideological theory, it was race-based theory, where some people's DNA made them, sadly, according to these people, and condoned by their cultural fellow travellers, their DNA made them somehow better than others. That was all scripted. And then he said, I've seen that sort of philosophy before. I saw it in Nazi Germany. We all did. We've seen it elsewhere in the world, in the horrors of history. Now, I'm going to put something out there, and I'd love your guys' take on this. The philosophy that Nazi Germany had that led to the horror of history that Winston Peters has said, right? He said, we've seen the philosophy in Nazi Germany, and that's an example of one of the horrors of history. What's that word for the horrors of history that was in Nazi Germany that we've seen before? So if people can't see the connection to comparing co-governance to the Holocaust, then they're either morons or they're being willfully ignorant. They are choosing not to see it. Justine? I mean, it's just classic debate bro logic where it's like, well, he said one and one equals question mark, but he didn't say it equal two. You know, it's like, yeah, but some, you know, like it's, <laughs> it's just like, yeah, it's total nonsense, right? And it's like, it's just, it's like um, high school shit. Like it's high school debate level stuff. Um, we know what we were, he was alluding to. He wasn't alluding to the fact that, suppose, you know, if the trains were running on time or, you know, whatever people say about fascism. He was alluding to the Holocaust and he knew what he was saying. And we're totally, we're more than justified in our outrage about it. So, yeah, yeah. no. Um, I give it apps like, like I just sorry I can't stand when people do that. Eh? It's just like this like obscene literalism where it's like no, but you know, it's like we know what he was saying, um, and we're yeah we're reacting to that. Uh, Kelvin, yeah, petulant bullshit using the good old um, degrees from Facebook University <laughs> in, a, in a nutshell. Simple as that, you know, yeah. just real petulant behavior trying to push back lament yeah unintelligent um indeed they're basically insulting everyone's intelligence trying to pull that crap at yeah. the end of the day yeah i mean yeah yeah i mean so, i got like i made a, i made a tweet about it and i got like sat, like hundreds of abusive comments from you know these right-wing trolls basically saying no he didn't say that he wasn't comparing it to the holocaust but anyways the holocaust didn't happen and if it did happen it was good you know which is like exactly the kind of thing they pull is they're always um, you know, it's always just a moving goalpost or they're, you know, yeah. So, um, no, it was a pretty awful day, really. It, like, brings out the worst. The conversation brings out the worst of people. And he's, he remains unapologetic for those people swarming in to threads like yours, you know, the white supremacist bullshit. And, yeah. um, and so it goes on. I mean, how in his right mind can he not actually see that and the damage that it's doing to him? It's well, he just, can. He can, yeah. he, he's playing a revolting game speaking to his base. He can see it. He's smart enough to know that.